One of the basic tactics of warfare is to attack your enemy without being seen. Ever since the great nation states took to the sea, the idea of a submarine had been tried many times, but had always ended in complete failure. However, in 1774, within the confines of Plymouth Sound, a carpenter called John Day, who had already had some success with smaller submersibles, determined to go one step further. Day converted a small sailing vessel, the Maria, and in June sunk it with himself on board in 120 feet of water, midway between Drake's Island and Firestone Bay. Almost at once there was a huge explosion of air bubbles on the surface, and in spite of some hastily organised rescue attempts, John Day and his submarine were never seen again. However, Day's experiments caused a great deal of interest, and there was no doubt that a trend had been set. 